live from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, we've got baseball on the show. The Atlanta Braves and the Milwaukee Brewers. And now, first pitch your coming your way next. 2022 Milwaukee Brewers. All right, ready to get underway. Here's Eddie Rosario. And the pitch. Just missed. Comes up empty. That's strike two. Three balls, two strikes to count. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Righty delivers. Now that's smack to right center. Kane pulls it down, and there's one down. Not fooled at all right there. He was clearly all over it, but sometimes you hit it too hard and right at someone. You're looking for one of those bloop hits to get a knock sometimes. Stays alive. One and two now. Popped up. Brasso puts it away. And there's two away. Two outs. Base is empty. Matt Olson up to the plate. This guy has turned into a beast. Two down. Nobody on. Swings and misses. And one down below the zone. One, two now. Got him. And that'll do it. Bottom of the first. Colton Wong up to hit. This is a guy you got to keep an eye on when he digs in. Definitely been known to drop a drag bunt from time to time. And he's pretty good at it, Chris. Yeah, and he creates a, a sense of urgency for the defense because of the speed, because of the ability to put down that bond. Olsen steps on the bag. One gone, bottom half of the first. Willie Adamas stands in. Swing and a ball hammered. Left field. That's back there. And it's gone. He sends it out of here. And they jump out front. It's one nothing. Here's Yelich at the dish. Next offering clips the zone count even at two. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. And now it's filled up. Part of the order coming through now. And with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. Next offering is fouled back. And here it comes. That one out to right. Rosario on the move. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's two down. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. The wind of the pitch. Inside. Swing and a high fly ball to left. Ozuna settles under this one. Makes the catch. That is the inning. Back here in Milwaukee, here's Marcelo Zuna. Swing and a miss. One and two. Wow. Good luck catching up to that one. Next pitch is outside. The count now two and two. And the righty deals. Swing and a tapper. The throw to first. 
Leadoff man retired here in the second. Here's Austin Riley. The third baseman. Austin Riley. One down, base is empty. Fought off foul. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Two away now. Two outs, base is empty. Now it's the veteran outfielder, Adam Duvall. Swing and a miss. And the count is one and two. Kicks and deals. That one ripped but foul. Next offering is down low. Two balls, two strikes. That's inside. Three and two. And there's no, ball four. Ball four that's Man, it. that's a tough one to take on the full count, but I guess he saw it really well. It's a really nice plate appearance. Dansby Swanson is going to get a chance to hit. And a pitch. Swing and a foul ball at the plate. They'll do it again. And the right hater deals. Tapped softly on the ground. Wong gloves it. Tosses to first. And Swanson is set down. And the inning is over. We head to the bottom of the second. Leading off, Rowdy Telez. The 1-1 one -one is upstairs. And yeah, that's ball two. The wind of the pitch. Swing and a miss. Kicks and fires. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. And that's the first out. Now it's Hunter Renfro. The wind and the pitch. And now it's three and two. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. Omar Narvaez at the plate. Strike two. One ball, two strikes. And now the lefty. Two balls, two strikes. And it's fouled away. Why to kick the pitch? Swing and a ball popped up. And it drops in. So a two-out knock keeps the inning alive. Gotta love the resiliency he showed in that at bat, battling with two strikes. When you flare a ball out behind second base, it's really a tough spot for anyone to get to. And you're never trying to do that as a hitter, but when you do, I tell you what, you're yelling at it the entire way to get down. Line drive, and it goes just foul. Look out, that ball is smoked. Man, I am so relieved that they have this netting down the lines. Just ensure safety for the fans. Last thing is a player you want to look up and see a fan get hit. Next offering is foul back. Two outs. This one popped up. And puts the squeeze on that. And that is the third out of the inning. Welcome back. On to the third inning. Now it's the DH, Alex Dickerson.
pitch. Short hop liner handled it short. Over to first. Lead off man retired here in the third. And now it's Travis Darno with the play. The catcher. Travis Darno. Right hander kicks deals. The other way. He's got it. And there's two away. Eddie Rosario now next up for the Braves. The right 0 for 1 so far. And a 2-1 on the way. That's a ball. The right-hander gives up the two-out walk. One of the things about that two-out walk, the base runner over at first base is going to have a very aggressive secondary lead. So a ball down the line or an into the gap will produce a two-out RBI, and those are the best. That is if you are the offensive side of it. Next offering is downstairs. Rosario off of first with two away. Here's the 2-2. On the ground, right side. Wong to first. And Albies is retired. And that is that. Back here at the ballpark, now the third baseman, Michael Brasso. And a 1-1. Way inside, gets out of the way. He needs a quick 1-2-3 this time around. Last inning, through a lot of pitches. 2-1 pitches in there, and the count is even. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. That one misses, and now three and two. The pitch. That one misses, so a leadoff walk. Oh, looking for a swing and miss right there, or for the ump to help him out and make the call with that last pitch, but neither happened. Close pitch, but a good take to earn that walk. At the belt and fires. And a swing and a miss. And one away. Now the number two hitter, Willie Adamas. He's already homered in this game. To first, might be two. Over to Swanson. He turns it back to first for two, and that'll do it. to the fourth and now Matt Olson that one in for a strike two and two he's been pitching well but going through this middle of the order second time through we'll see what kind of adjustments are being made chopped left side gets it to first and one gone to the fourth as they get the leadoff man and next will be the cleanup hitter, Marcelo Zuna. The Braves still looking for their first hit in this one. And the next pitch is way outside. Well, he might have to look for a different put-away pitch right here, 2-2. He's already seen the curveball a couple of times in this at-bat, so might have it timed up and ready for it. Next one in the dirt. comes a pitch and a swing and a miss down on strikes now two out two outs base is empty here's the third baseman Austin Riley and one and two And a swing and a miss, and that's that. Bottom 
of the fourth. Now it's going to be Christian Yelich. The one-two. Good eye right there. And a pinch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. The two-two. Slapped foul. Stays alive. And he deals. Foul ball. and miss struck him out one gone here and now it's Andrew McCutcheon fly to left his first time up out to short Swanson handles fires to first on the run already two gone here in the home fourth Rowdy Telez up now for the Brewers he was a strikeout victim his first time That's ripped to right down the line. Dives, but it falls. And now it looks like extra bases. And that's a two-out double. He's a pull hitter, and that's about as much as you can pull one and keep it fair. So no surprise right there. Nothing the shifted defense can do about it, though. Now it's Hunter Renfro. Got him looking. That ends the frame. here at American Family Field. Ready now for the fifth inning. Adam Duvall at the plate. Next offering is foul back. The pitch. Ripped on a line. And a quick out number one. Dansby Swanson stands in. Swanson, former first-round pick by the Arizona Diamondbacks. Vanderbilt player in college, college World Series player, all that good stuff, but really coming into his own. Started after the 1-2 pitch, appeal to first. No swing, says Freddie Ferguson. Now all even up. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Down the line towards the corner. Renfro sizes this one up. Makes a nice running catch. And there's two down. Two out. Space is empty. Now it's Alex Dickerson. The Braves hitless so far in the game. Next offering is in for a strike. Now this offense has just been locked down. Almost five full innings of shutout baseball. Next one misses, and the count is even, two and two. Two and two. Swing and a miss, and he got him. And good work there as he gets a one, two, three. And welcome back. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Here's the Brewers catcher now, Omar Narvaez. Pitch misses inside, and now three and one. Here's an opportunity to do some damage and perhaps unlock this offense. Three one count, be ready to turn on a fastball. Probably tried to nibble right there and just missed his spot. Hitter didn't offer at it. Now he has somebody to worry about over at first. Now it's Lorenzo Kane. He popped out his first time.
And a pitch. Right through there. Got him. And one gone. Now batting Michael Brasso. Worked to walk in his first trip to the plate. Narvaez, the runner at first with one gone in the inning. Next pitch inside, and the count is filled up. Kick Sandios. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. So the batting order turns over. Here's the second baseman, Colton Wong. The pitch. In the air to left center. Ozuna under this one. And that ends the inning. Top of the sixth inning. Here's the catcher, Travis Dardo. Here's a 1 1. This one smacked out to left center. In there, base hit. And the bid for history is gone. Safe at second with nobody out, and he represents the tying run. Now it's the right fielder, Eddie Rosario. He's 0 for 1. The 1 1. Inside, just missed. Runner at second, nobody out. The next pitch misses, and that's ball three. Man at second. Fouls one away, and now three and two. The pitch. And fouled off. Left-hand batter waits. And ball four, two aboard. That could jumpstart an offense that's really struggled to score in this one. Don't want to wake a team up with the free pass. First and second, no outs. Here is Ozzy Albies up to hit. Swings through that one. Well, he knows they don't want to give him anything to hit, but when you've got opportunities to drive in runs, you've got to expand the zone. He's capable of going. Now this one gets through. Around third. Fires to the plate. Slide save. We're tied at one. Gets it done to drive in the run and tie it back up. Handled that down and in breaking ball very well. I saw the break early coming from the other side and just let it get deep enough and drop the barrel on it at the very last moment. And that one fouled off. Stays alive. First and second here, no outs. Line drive, caught! Yeah, that was a wasted RBI opportunity, but competitor like him, he is looking forward to making up for it in his next at bat. Comes a 2-2. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. Tosses to the pitcher, covering the bag. Out on the toss to the pitcher. Runners advance to second and third. Now the third baseman, Austin Riley. Rosario, the runner at third. Albies on at second with two down. Two two now, and a foul ball. He stays alive. And here it comes. Ripped to third and caught. here in Milwaukee bottom of the six up now for Milwaukee Willie Adamas the 2-1 this game has been so tight feels like the next team to score will win it and a pitch got him 
one away. Now it's Christian Yelich. And that one handled to first. And a couple of quick outs. Two outs, base is empty. Here's Andrew McCutcheon to hit. The wind of the pitch. That's in there. And now two and two. Two down, nobody on. Three balls, two strikes. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. The wind of the pitch. Bounce to the left side. A dive. Nice stop. Nicely done for the out. New pitcher on now, Jake Cousins. Number 54. set for the start of the inning. Here's the center fielder, Adam Duvall. Three, two now. Stays alive. Here's a high chopper, and he grabs it in foul ground. Rolled over to third. Rosso tosses to first. That's the first out in the top of the seventh. So now to the plate for Atlanta. Dansby Swanson. Next offering is in the dirt. This is a really good feeling for a hitter. At this point in the ball game, you know that they don't want to walk you, so you're going to get a pitch to hit. You just better not miss it. And the right-hander deals. Bounce to third. And two away to start the seven. Two outs, space is empty. And now the DH, Alex Dickerson. Ball to strike. Rolled softly, but that goes foul. Righty to the plate. And a swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. Tyler Matzik will take over on the mound. He has a great slider with tons of movement. Bottom of the inning, up now for Milwaukee, Rowdy Telez. And now the lefty squibbed out in front of the plate. In plenty of time to first and one away in the bottom of the seventh. Good late bite on that slider. Got the hitter out in front, rolled over on it. Exactly what it was supposed to do. At the belt and fires. And a foul ball. Next offering upstairs. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Swing and a miss. And he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Omar Narvaez up now for the Brewers. Left-hand hitter waits. 
And a foul ball. Starting to get some pretty good timing on that breaking ball, but he's going to have to stay ready for a fastball. Don't want to watch one go right by you. Got him. That's the third out. Ready to begin the eighth. And now the catcher comes up to him. Travis Darno. Payoff pitch. It's a leadoff walk. And that's the go-ahead run. Back to the leadoff spot in the Braves lineup. And next for Atlanta, Eddie Rosario. And the righty deals. And that's ball four. Well, interesting. He went with the off speed and walked the hitter. Man, you got to challenge the guy with the fastball. Go ahead, run on base. Ozzy Albies up to the plate. Next offering misses. Now two balls and a strike. Right handed reliever. That one fouled off two and two. No outs, runners at first and second. In the air, right field, Renfro moving under it. Makes the grab, and there's one down. And now Matt Olson up to hit. Got to be careful with a slugger like this because he can turn it into a three-run game in the blink of an eye. Kicks and fires. Line drive. And off the base of the wall. Throw comes in quickly. Holds that go-ahead run at third. And there's still one away. Just a huge at bat right there. Nice line drive to the pull side. Met it out front, but just stayed through it nice enough and ripped it into the outfield. Now at the plate, Marcelo Zuna. And a count one and two. I think ultimately you want to tie him up, get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. The next offering misses, and the count is two and two. In the infield at the corners, don't be surprised to see them come home first and prevent that run from scoring. No trouble here, puts it away for the out. Both runners tagging from second and third. He scores on the sack fly, it's 2-1. Sometimes all you got to do is your job and don't overcomplicate things. Keep it simple. Runner right third, less than two outs. Put the ball in play and a nice job with the sack fly. Luke behind second. Base hit and a run in to score. Well done. Drives in the run. That's one of those things where as a hitter, you kind of feel like you were due for something like that to drop in for you. No matter how good or bad you've been swinging the bat as of late. And he just fought it off and dropped it in there perfectly. Here comes a new arm for the Brewers, Yandel Gustave. And he'll do his best to keep this close. So two on with two away. Adam Duvall next up for the Braves. And a pitch. And a swing and a miss. Good job at damage control right there. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth, Colin McHugh. And he'll work on holding this lead. Welcome back. And now, Lorenzo Cain. We talk about guys with good speed, and definitely he has it. But pushing the offense aside for just a second, Chris, it's the defensive side that I think the speed factors in the most. Righty delivers. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Leadoff man is out here in the eighth. Next for Milwaukee, Michael Brasso. A strikeout and a walk. The pitch. Well, he gets to balls that get by most people at that position. Just really impressive because there are certain times the ball comes off the bat, automatically that team that hit it thinks that they've got a base hit or they may have extra bases, and he just takes it away. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And now two gone. Colton Wong up now for the Brewers. 
And what makes him even quicker is the fact that he's so dialed in on the pitch as it's moving through the hitting zone. He can see how that hitter's lined up, what he's trying to do, and where that pitch is going to end up, which gives him that really quick first step. And that's why he makes so many great plays. Next one misses three and one. Right-hander kicks, deals. Swing and a miss as he was late that time. And a payoff pitch. Fly ball to right. Rosario makes the catch, and that'll do it. New inning getting started. Here's the shortstop at the play. Dansby Swanson. The 1-1. One -one. And a good That's eye there. Here comes a pitch. Fouls one off. 2-2. Two two. Flew open a little bit with that front shoulder, but was able to slow his bat down just enough to make contact with that pitch. Keep the bat alive. Base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. All over that one right there. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity. Right on top of it. Here's Dickerson now. Next pitch is outside. And the right hater deals. And that's down and away. No, he's really working him away, this at bat. Sometimes take a little bit off velocity. Try to get a rollover, something on the ground. Stay away from that big hole on the right side of the infield. Pretty easy walk right there. Last pitch wasn't even much to think about. Travis Dardo, next up for the Braves. One for two. And a pitch. And a breaking ball drops in for a strike. Looking for some insurance. Or as our friends down in the South would say, insurance. No matter how you say it, we know what you mean. And that one in the air center field. Kane makes the play. Runner tagging for third. And he moves up 90 feet. Runners at the corners now. One away. Back to the top of the lineup. Now the leadoff spot for the Braves, Eddie Rosario. And the pitch. Grounder might be two. Off balance feed, there's one. On to Telez, and the double play ends the inning. Kenley on here, trying to protect this lead. All set for the bottom of the ninth. Now it's the shortstop, Willie Adamas. The wind and the pitch. This one popped up. Foul ground, first base side. Olsen racing over to make the catch. And now it's Christian Yelich. Three two now, and a foul ball. He stays alive. The pitch to the right side. All these off balance throw in time. Yelich out on the play. Andrew McCutcheon up now for the Brewers. He's someone that you might not describe as having elite level speed, but he can absolutely move, and it is a factor in his game. And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. Great pitcher's duel in this one. You get to a certain point where each pitcher is trying to outdo the other, go a little bit deeper into the ball game, and for these guys, it really came down to a few key at-bats. This was a fun one to watch. And your final, 3-1. Kenley Jansen picking up the save for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Chambi saying so long.
final line score for our ball game this afternoon for the 